Let me introduce myself to y'all because some of y'all don't really know me. Ooh. I am a racist. Oh God, please protect me from my melanin foe. He was reaching for his wallet in response to my oppression, so I responded with aggression. Oh God, please protect me. His African identity is a threat to me after it can no longer be of use to me. Oh God, please protect me. See, George had to die so that I can be alive. Please purify these heathens. Oh God, please protect me. Hands up, hands behind your head. I want to see you reach for that gun that you're hiding behind your ear so I can end your predestined life with the words. Shots fired. Man down, no lives matter, so get on the ground. You're still a threat to me even when it's 12 to 1. Oh God, please help me, I just killed somebody's son. See, it's BLM this and BLM that. Oh, don't move, baby girl, before I shoot you in the back. Wait, see, I pledge allegiance to our Confederate flag. Red, white, and blue in the flag that I hold in my right hand while I turn the ground. Red, white, and blue with your face slammed. See, I don't really know what you want from me. I pay my taxes and my dues, but your black skin is still looking at me so awkwardly. See, it's a manhunt for that one runt who won't put his hands up when I point my sidearm at him, basically. And he wants to say that I profiled him racially. So why the hell is his black skin looking at me so aggressively? Oh God, please protect me. Because I tried to subdue them systemically. We spent more money trying to preserve wildlife than we ever did the black life. Because dogs is man's best friend. And a black man's life is a life predestined to end. Oh God, please protect me. Let me introduce myself to y'all because some of y'all don't really know me. I am his melanin foe. Oh God, please protect me from my white oppressor. I was reaching for my ID when he saw me and began to open fire. My African identity is a threat to him after all the cotton has been picked. I can't breathe three simple words, loosen the noose around the neck of my child. He said I can't breathe. Lynching, taking a new form in this generation. Take your knee off his neck, you supposed guardian angel. He said I can't breathe. You white men call that keeping the peace. But what I call keeping the peace is that even after George was murdered in cold blood, his daughter told an entire nation to stop. Don't hurt nobody, daddy wouldn't have wanted that. See, that's keeping the peace. But I cannot peel the black off my skin the way they peel their identities by changing their looks and their kin. See, after slavery, I was segregated. Did you know that now there is triple the amount of me incarcerated? Slavery was never abolished, it was redesigned, remade, and then hidden behind poor healthcare and my chances of getting an education. I was thrown into the ghetto, forced to sell drugs for the future of the next generation. And you want to say you abolished slavery? <laughs> well, congratulations. <sighs> Hands up. Hands behind your head. Officer, please don't shoot. I ain't got no street cred. Oh God, please protect me. And I swear to God, they weren't born racist. They were taught. It's not that all cops aren't bad. It's only you've seen the few that were caught. Because if all lives matter, then why is it why is it wrong for me to say that black ones do? See, the land of the free is a land of the free for the white man. So God, please protect me.